We are back in Northern Lights with our double fire. And it's time for us to head down the way a bit. Uh, we're doing okay. We got enough stamina and stuff. Doing pretty good. It's been a little bit of a rough road up here. Trying to get ourselves to Mysterious Woods and the storyline of the brand new update that occurred not too long ago. So we still have to find some stuff here and reach out to see if we can find a snowmobile key. Uh, definitely not in here. People ask me, why didn't you make the fire inside? Because you can make it inside, by the way. I, I just, for realism... <laughs> <laughs> Try in Tennessee to stay away. Oh, what the hell? Does the stuff come back on reload, really? Or did I not save it properly? It's possibly I didn't save up properly. <laughs> it's all good. Well, actually, I'll know right away. Oh, maybe... I'm not sure anymore. Damn it. Anyways, it's all good. Um, it, it might not be a reload thing. It's all good. We had some rifle bullets here. I didn't see anything else. I didn't see a snow build key. I was hoping that we'd be able to find that right away. No, my stuff is on the ground. That's okay. It's all good. We'll make that happen. Also, people are mentioning uh, the reason why... Oop, I just go back to the fire because I like to keep nice and warm. Mm, uh, how much left on fire? Looks tasty. What looks tasty? The water? Dude, you got issues. When you start looking at water, it says it looks tasty. It's time to take it easy. Uh, but yes, uh, we're going to have to head out with, way down there. But you guys were mentioning that while I was crafting, that I should have. By the way, I'm just going to go through here. Burns, which we found out about. <laughs> Oops. Uh, but we need to craft. When we craft up the actual spear itself, it takes up the knife. So that's good to know. Um, I didn't really read that. I decided it was uh, regular, but it's all good. So it takes up the knife. And uh, we could probably make ourselves another one of these. Just in case. And then there we go. We should have our knife on us. So that's very, very cool. Thank you so much for everybody at Confields. Again, if you guys and girls are enjoying this, this struggle in the middle of the forest. Please go ahead to the like button if you're brand new. Please go and subscribe. Thank you for being so amazing. We have some burnt rabbit meat. We're not going to be able to eat. Well, we could probably eat it, but I'm just choosing not to. I'm really just saying no to it and go. I'm not even sure if I need the vodka. I got some extra stuff on me here. I even have some sticks. I'm going to need to gather some more on our way there. And our blades. So I'm going to put the blade in uh, number four. Uh, we have one spear. We have an axe. So this is a good way to start for today. We should head down the way. And I guess I'll pick up said stick. Is this a stick, though? Yeah, it's a stick. Okay, so that way. Let's open up our compass. Yeah, I think we need to find the road again. And we'll come back to this place. Let's close the door in case somebody else needs it. We ransacked the crap of it, but it's all good. Uh, can I extinguish this? I don't know if I can, actually. Mm, Maybe I need to put water in it. Tasty. Uh, but I'm going to need to drink this anyway, so... I wonder, wait a second. Let's just... No. Just consume. Take my can back. Put it back in here. And I don't see extinguish anywhere. Nope. All right. Oh, unless it's set at the bottom left. Nope, just says sword items. Okay. Well, if you guys know how to do it, go ahead and calm feels. All right, let's get ourselves back out here. We are going to grab the said ropes because they're important. We will need a lot of them. On our way down here. Oh boy, it looks freaking cool. What is that over there? Is that tree stump? Okay. I thought it was something else. It's a little different at night. What is this? Oh, it's just a freaking rock. God, I thought it was a cargo or something. Some kind of like loot we can pick up. That would have been pretty cool. Yeah. Grab, grab, rope, super importanto. How's my weight, by the way? 25.9, not bad. Uh, female deer, we'll leave her alone. And we need just to find the road again. I think the road is to the left. It's the best way to follow it. So that way it will lead us to where we need to go. Honestly, I don't want to get too lost in this. And we do have a compass. We know where we're going. We also have a map. We can see that. That's for sure. i got to be careful not to overrun. Obviously, because he's going to run out of stamina. And we don't need more coffee. We didn't find any coffee. Uh, we have the pelts, by the way. Those uh, rabbit pelts are right now on that location. So we'll remember to go back. Hopefully, the cure is up. It's inside the building. So that's pretty good, too. All right, let's get ourselves down this road here and see what we can do. Did I tell you the game? I like the story. I like that we're going into a story now. I think the developer is working his butt off and getting things done. And uh, you know what? It just keeps on getting updates, and he has a mission to finish this up properly. So I'm I'm all in for it. I'm all in for it. Okay, so where are we now? Let's just double-check to see if we're doing good here. Yeah, right there. Uh, that's where the snowmobile is. we got to make sure we keep that little check on there. Now, the path over here, like I said, there are, of course, vehicles. We suppose we just crashed and the weather changed. So we should be, uh, yeah, the weather changed and got even worse than it was before in Siberia. You'd think that would be impossible, but it is true. There's a fox here. No worries in this game. Foxes are not violent animals. Don't bother them. They won't bother you. You know what I'm saying? That's another thing, like I was mentioning last time, the AI is going to change a lot. The developer is working on that, too. So that's very cool. Okay, so I should be... 
entering that area now. Yeah, we're there. Mysterious Woods. And we're going to try and get some high ground and see if there's anything around here. We'll take out our binoculars. I think I see it already. Yep. Let's mark it. There's some tower over there, too. I think, is it the science place? I think it might be, dudes and dudes. I think it might be. Now, the other location we went to, right here, it didn't mark it. I don't know why it does that. Uh, some people said you had to go up the road for it to work. We're going to try this one here. This one currently is a question mark. So let's see if it actually pops up and gives us a location. Or maybe just the smaller locations don't do that. I don't know. It would be cool if we could actually mark it ourselves. Get in there, put cabin. Change the little question mark to... Oh, no, I know what this is. It's cabin. This is a place I know what it is, too. Weather station. So this one worked. Uh-huh. Okay. This must be oh. the weather measuring station we have contact with. Dude. You scared my own thoughts. <laughs> Freaked me out, dude. Okay. Well, I know it's probably locked, right? There's got to be a key somewhere. Yeah, I know. I think I know where he is. Yep. Loot. We found a key. Wicked. Is there anything inside these? The duffel bags? Nothing in these ones. I know inside, I think there's a couple of those duffel bags. But he also changed and worked on all the containers and how loot is spawned. So a lot of things change. If you had an older game you're playing, it probably won't work as well as starting a brand new game. So if you're not aware. Yeah, there's nothing else in here. Is there anything on top of these things? No. Super creepy. I don't think we can loot up anything in these areas here either. There's some locked... Oh, there we go. These storage crates. Uh, these are storage areas we can use for now. Uh, people ask me, why don't I use uh, storage crates and this uh, Things you can drop them on the ground. Nothing despawned that I remember, so... I don't worry about it too much. Oh, yeah. Okay. I remember this place. These ones still don't work. Okay, I thought they opened up beforehand. I don't know if it's just me, but possible. A mad bull. <laughs> okay. A little energy drink, I'm guessing. All right, open up here. More rope, cloth. We're good. The only thing I do use, but natural, is a ginseng. Korean ginseng tea. It's one thing I do love a lot. Parka, holy moly. All right, wait, keep uh, yourselves warm. Uh, crucial aspects of survival in the Arctic conditions. Although, to start with clothes, you can find equipment and clothes which may provide better stats. And then, okay, current ones, of course. Tips, remember, you can carry clothes on your cells, but not in your backpack. Equipping a new clothing item will swap the current one. Absolutely. Now, here's the thing, all right? The quality on top, you can see the first one. Those uh, quality is a little bit lower. So that's the problem with it. But... It outweighs, of course, down below where it's, you can see that I, I'm going to stay warmer and also shields me from damage, And but it also decreases the speed because I'm a little heavier. Screw it. Fleece jacket. Say goodbye. We're not going fleece. All right, we'll hit this rooms here so I don't get too confused with what I'm checked. Oh, toque. I take said toque. Oh, my toque is like shite. Cod? Yeah, okay, it's wool. That's why. Man, that can be is itchy, itchy, itchy. <laughs> Instant noodles. Some ramen. Hmm, computers. Mm. We should check them out. You should check them out. What's this? Push pin. Oh, yeah. I think the push pins, I think that's what we can use for marking more places on the map. If you have more push pins, you can do so. All right, this is not working. This is not working. I don't think there's power in this place, dude. Access denied. Oh. ID card required. Okay. Mm. I know where it is. I remember from the guy. That snowmobile would definitely oh. help me get around this island faster. Oh, we need fuel, I bet you, too. Instant noodles. All right, we'll take said instant noodles. Oh, uh, wool tube. This is in better condition than what we just got. Okay, so super important to take a look. I'm not sure if they put anything like on the ground, like the long dark does, to make it, make it super nasty hard for us to find things. Kind of prefer when they're not too hard to find, but it's all good, especially those kind of primo stuff. All right, just checking to see if there's anything in the box. I don't think I've ever seen anything in there. All right, we'll hit the right side across. What's this? All right, these are actually in not as good as what we have. At, at rain pants. Yeah, I, I think we're going to keep... What do I have on me right now? Jeans. Yeah, I prefer to have the jeans. Wait a second. Did he get... 
Wait, one second. All right, no, okay. I thought I saw my breath because of that. I was like, what the hell? That's like instantaneous, cold. It's already cold in here. A flight jacket. Uh, obviously, yeah, I mean, it's in great condition, but not good for us. We're not going to beat out the parka. Oh, yeah, cookie pie. I just saw that. It's like, what the hell? Take it easy. Look at the, every little bits on those things. We might go back to the old ones. This is where the key card is, not mistaken. Yes, scientist ID. All right, some orange soda, some paper debris. You can see there's a lot less stuff. Oh, hell yeah, climbing boots. What do we have right now? Leather boots. <laughs> yeah. So right now, all that automatically goes in here. You can see the quality around on these. I tell you exactly. This cotton tuke is crap and some cloth. Be able to make ourselves some more stuff. Anything else on top of these? I don't think so. Okay, we're in good shape. Work pants. Yeah, better. Coffee powder. Beautiful. Light jacket. Not going to work for us. We got set parka. I get some of that stuff going to get broken. Ooh, wool knit hat. Interesting. You got to be very, very, very careful. Instant noodles. F uh, fleece jacket. Yeah, no, not happening. My parka is the best. Need me a parka, dude. I will finish up polluting here. Yeah, they're a little bit better. But the same, right? Cod gloves, leather gloves. Really? Leather gloves are better? I don't know about that, but maybe these ones will just be you know, better overall. It's fine. I'll take it. I thought there was a second floor of this place, but I don't think it's here. I know there's another place that has like multiple floors. Okay, coffee and stuff. That would be pretty good to have. We can sleep here if we want to. How is it the temperature in this uh, place? Uh? Well, it's not so bad, actually. In here is, uh, wow, 0. 0.1 Celsius. That's pretty good. We're keeping ourselves warm. Uh, blueberry juice. Yeah, fleece jacket. Not going to happen. Sleep in bed. Don't feel like sleeping right now. I have no more room for this. Is there anything I can eat fast on the run here? I think we should boil these noodles, not mistaken. Put coffee powder. Let's see if I can sort this out. I, I believe I like this better than vodka. We're just going to consume vodka for shits and giggles. Okay, that was a really bad idea. I want to know. Yeah, there we go. Now we know what the effects are. Take some blueberry juice and bring back our hydration. <laughs> All right, we got a little bit of blurriness. He drank the whole thing. You know, he just couldn't take it a sip. I need the whole bottle, dude. All right, sorry, dude. I wish I could help you out there, but you're dead. So yeah, the blurriness will go in a bit. No. Oh, this can't be true. I need to report back to base. Wow. Look at the weather reports. Minus 15, minus 26, minus 34, minus 42 Celsius. January missing data. So we're looking at really cold weather. And it looks like I got to go that way. But I'm thinking the best route we should take is go and find a snowmobile and test that baby out. That's what we should be doing, right? So it's daylight. I could take a little bit of a rest here. Okay, so 7 o'clock in the morning. We're in pretty good shape. We can use this for storage if we want to. We can drop it on the ground still, I believe. We need to head back home. I'm going home. Yeah, sorry for that dude in there, man. I feel bad for him. Okay, so we got some stamina. We still have that burn affliction. It's going to take the bar to go up here. Uh, infection risk. Holy balls. Okay. This is not good. Okay, I'm actually not concentrating on this, and I should be concentrating on making that bandage again. Do I have any more? I think I have sap still, don't I? I think I do. All right, uh, let's go back up here. Where are we going here again? We have to go into this crafting here, I believe. There we go. It's not separated. Craft that up. And I believe that takes away the infection. Correct? I believe so. Infection risk. Where did my... There it is. Painkillers, painkillers, charcoal. Charcoal's for upset stomach, I think. There we go. Use sap dressing. So does that help out a lot? Yes. Okay, so now that took away the chance of infection. So if we can find any more sap... 
Uh, on our way there, be fantastic. I'm right now at 30 pounds. I gotta kinda be careful. This will be the last rope I grab. I think we have enough rope for our way there. So they want us to go all the way up there. Whoop. That's a contrary where we want to go. Or is that the snowmobile? Is that the cut through the snowmobile? Oh, look at that. They actually want me to go and pick it up. So should we cut through? Let's just see the compass. I'm going the right way. Yeah, I am. Okay, so not the right location back there. That is for sure. Uh, just bring me somewhere else completely. So I'm happy I didn't follow it. I was like, no, no, this is not going the right way. So I picked up a couple of things, didn't find any sap at all, hoping to find some of uh, those trunks. Anybody home? We were here before, dumb nuts. Oh my god, the whole fire goes? You're kidding me. Really? All right, we'll get the snowmobile. At this point, I'm probably going to eat something. So look at food here. It brings back some hunger and stuff on us. So let's just consume this. We're in pretty good shape. If I can just make sure that burn doesn't uh, become an infection, it'd be really cool. So we need to keep to you heading out towards... Yeah, we're heading right for it. If we cut through here. Oh, I think I might see some sap. There might be some on that. How heavy am I right now? Oh, okay. Well, that's a big problem. All right, we can destroy this. We don't really need this. That. That. I'm going to make a sap, a uh, dressing right away. So just in case of emergency, we're going to make ourselves another one. I don't even know if I have enough cloth. Missing. Okay, at least we have two of those done. And the, that's all it is, is cloth for those, right? Yeah. So I'm hoping to sap on this thing, right? No, it's mushrooms, unknown mushrooms. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, damn it. I was so sure that was sap for a second. I was like, there's a little bit of sap for us. All right, we're a little bit heavy again. This didn't do shite for us last time. Not that much, at least. So put some of those down. Not going to help out with infection. He yeah, has a little bit of load issues still going into some of these parts, but that's okay. It's not that, like uh, horrible. Oh, wait, there's another one here. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Okay. So let's... I should have made a fire. I'm probably going to make one. Bandage. Did I drop my bandages? You shit. I dropped the bandages back there. I, there's no way I'm going to find that. Okay, so snowmobile should be down the way here, but I'm not sure I'll be able to make it there before I get some hypothermia. You see, that's just exactly right there. Right? Let's go back to our uh, trusty watch. Yeah, we're about to hit the hypothermia. But that's how you check your food and water right there. Always need to keep those replenished and stuff. I think I'm going to build it right now. I know the snowbill's over there, but God darn it. Oh, how far are we? We're right on it. We could do it. Can we? I don't think we can, actually. I'm thinking about it. We're going to probably get hypothermia. And that's the last thing I need right now. Got to think about my afflictions. Okay. Uh, craft. A shitty fire. Okay. And uh, tinder. No problem. I got some of those. And where's my fire starter gone to? Oh, crap. Okay, so craft. Fire starter. Where are you? Where are you? Craft. Did it drop it on the ground or did it put it here? Good. Wait, it took away the tinder after it did that? Okay, not too close, as we remember. Not a good thing. I actually am thirsty a tiny bit. I'm going to put those in here. I'm also going to make some noodles. So just press space bar and the water will start boiling up. Wish I had two cans, which I don't have. We're just down the street from it. Well, not too close again. We already had burns. I can't believe I made those stupid badges and those mushrooms took up the space. The charcoal, I mean, took up the space for it. 
Hopefully we'll find more cloth. Love that the cans and the water. Some things still need to be worked on, that's for sure. Looks tasty. Uh, we're gonna make some uh actually I don't need the noodles, I'm not hungry. Consume. Is there another way to make a bandage or it just needs cloth all the time? Yep, just cloth. Is there a way to make cloth? Rabbit fur gloves. Wanna make those. Yeah, I don't think there's any other way to make this. No, it's warm ourselves up. Make sure the bars are up to full. Then we can make our way out. Well, we still have to go back there, but with the snowmobile, this will be a lot better. Find out what happened. Find higher grounds and contact Homeland. Okay. Mmm. Looks tasty. Does it really? Like, is that something that looks tasty for you, dude? All right. We're in good shape of water. We just need to keep ourselves a little bit warmer. I'm probably just going to drink it up. Harvest. Fruit container. There we go. Make sure we don't leave that behind. Okay. I think we're good to go. Yep. Fantastico. So a little stop. A little warmth. And I should be surveying a little bit more. With the snow build, the thing about it, we're going to have to be careful. I'm not sure how fast it is, but if it's going to take us out, like, really quick to locations, it'll be... Oh, I kind of need his food, but... You know, I'm going to hold off a bit. I can't carry more. I wonder if there's storage in a snow build, like little saddlebags or something. I don't know. A little sled in the back. I don't think I've ever seen one. I think they usually have sleds in the back of those things, don't they? I'll be honest. I've never been on a snow build in real life. Seen them, and never been on them. Ah, oh, the tank is dry, empty. You're shit, me. There still has to be some fuel left on this island. You're kidding me. You made me walk all the way here for that. Oh, dude. Okay, so uh, I thought that was too easy, and I did say I wonder if there's fuel, but I figured there would be fuel in it. Okay, so I just stopped by the fire. I'm going to actually try out these unknown mushrooms. Cross our fingers and hope I don't die. All right. We're doing this together now. I think these mushrooms, I couldn't figure out what to do with them yet. You can eat them raw. I don't think that's a good idea. I'm just saying they're a little blackish and it kind of scare me a bit. Okay, 500 each in hunger, energy. All right, that gave us a little bit of boost. I used a big pot for that one too. Just to make sure. Oh, yeah. I oh, God. I don't need to carry that thing. I have two friggin' lighters, Game Edge. How friggin' crazy is that? i just so not used to finding good stuff. All right. I right, good. Yeah, keep that there in case of whatever happens. So that's shitty. Now we need to go back all the way back to where we were going to this place. Which I'm hoping. Have we been here before? There's some logs on the ground there. I'm hoping we'll be able to find some fuel in that location, but we have to come back all the way here, which does give you some some kind of hellish thing to go through. I thought there was going to be some fuel issues. I just knew it in my heart of hearts there was going to be fuel. All right, so we'll follow this down and see how far it can go, and I am nice and warm, right? right I'm starting to get a feeling I need to go up this hill to reach that point. I'm not sure. It does say 400 and something on that side. How far are we from everything here? Okay, we're still near the weather station back out, so it may be up on top of this hill. I'm not positive. But the only way for us to know is to go out that way. So I'm going to pick up sticks and stuff, get yourself ready for another fire. I went back to a location where I craft up uh, those badges. I couldn't find them. I maybe seeped into the ground or just despawned. Real shame. Considering I don't have that, that much cloth, I'll keep my eye out, of course, in my inventory. I didn't realize it just dropped out. Had to craft two game match. I thought I'd get ahead of my game. Do you know? Get a little bit of stuff going. Don't know why I didn't put the rest of the backpack. It's all good. Just wanted to make me struggle. Look at that little... What's this? Some poppies or... I don't know what these plants are. Okay. Well, we got to find out, right? Is that super heavy or something? What the hell? I did get rid of the spruce bark on this thing here. And... Man, I, I could make another fire stuff here. I need nests. I need the tree sap. 
I mean, I hope I don't need that. That's going to be pissing me off, I do. I need six of these, so I could drop this on the ground. I think it's six. All right, a little bit lighter. Hopefully these are good. Tell me that flower didn't... Yeah, okay. I was like, tell me that flower is not heavier than rock. We'll go around and see here. We're getting pretty close to it. Where the hell we're going. We can also survey around the area here. I don't see anything else. Doesn't look like anything is popping up on the screen either. Okay, they're going to make us go up high here. There's a floating... In case the devil's watching. There's something floating right here. All right. A little egg and, of course, a nest. I don't need them right now. Also going to be climbing up a mountain. Now, remember this being more difficult to find last time. All right, that's a science place, right, still? Yep. So we got the science area there. So it made us literally go all the way to Snowbill, which I should, guess I just gone up here a bit smarter. But I had to test it out. I was hoping. Okay, a little precarious up here. My super damn. I guess it is a steep climb though, in the snow too. Very hard to walk around this. Probably very deep in some ice. It'll really walk us through this. I wonder if I could have climbed it from the other side. All right, what's the temperature? Minus 33. Minus 27 in the sun with a window. And we are getting cold. We're halfway. I'm figuring it's going to get colder as we get higher, right? No, actually, it looks like it's getting a little bit warmer on that side, but I think it's a wind. Yeah. Hello? Quest complete. Oh. Can anyone hear me? If anyone is out there, the research done in the weather station shows the whole island is doomed because of an inexplicable phenomenon. Please, I need to be rescued as soon as possible. Help is not coming. I need to gather supplies and find a way out of this damned island. Yep, definitely not good. We're going to take a time and see if there's anything around here except for that science area. Okay, so we're going to have to go back down, right? I didn't see any fuel in that area. There is, of course, generators there, so I was hoping we'd find a way to uh, get at least one jerry can out of that, but it doesn't seem to be happening. There's another hovering nest. I guess there's supposed to be trees there. But we're going to make our way back down over there and start up a fire. Get ourselves all cozy for the night. We have a place to sleep. Uh, but I'm, I'm just exhausted. You can see that bomb there. It's not good. And plus, I have to worry about this now. I don't want to have any kind of hypothermia risk. I want to just take care of ourselves here. And what does it say? Scout the main locations of the island to find a way to escape. Yeah, I mean, a snowmobile would be awesome. I'm not sure we're going to escape. I don't know. I mean, I'm, I know the storyline's in, so I'm figuring we can escape. But I don't know how the hell we'll escape from this place. What's new? I don't think I ever heard them make noises before. All right, so the best thing to do is uh, start yourself a fire. I mean, you can make them inside. I'll showcase that today. It won't affect you or kill you. It's just if you want a little realism, it's probably best not to make it inside. You know what I'm saying? But uh, dealer's choice. As a few of you asked me why I didn't do it. And is it possible to do? It is. At least last I checked, it is. Oh, is there a stove here I can use? No, eh? I don't think there's any pot belly stoves or anything for these guys. They're all electric stuff, aren't they? Yeah, they're all electric stuff. Oh, well, it's okay. I was hoping we could find up some some other things, including... uh, Is that cloth again? Jeans, no. I, does that be cool? Can we rip those apart? Harvest, yes. Harvest, yes. Okay, I don't need the rope, though. I need to, to make myself another bandage. This time, we're going to keep our eyes on that bandage. We'll be able to see with the flooring, at least. I was hoping we could harvest that. Craft. All right, so I have two of those crafted. Open up here and double check. All right, so two of those are in here. And then we can craft up the rest of this. Let's make some room for this. 
because I'm going to need that ready to go. We're going to make ourselves a two-step or one-step dressing because I think we only have one. Missing other one yet. Cool. So in case of emergency, we can now use that. I'm not sure if I can fit his drop yet. I mean, while we're doing this, I don't think painkillers are going to help for the burns, but I'm not positive they won't. Use painkillers. Affliction cured burns. Are you freaking kidding me? Painkillers? I'm not even going there. Okay. Well, that's all cool with me, man. I'll take it. All right. So uh, let's make that fire. You guys are ready. It is almost nightfall. I look like I can get a backlift out, too. Okay. Uh, open this up here. Fire. Craft indoors. Why not? Oh, I can make the other one. I always find rocks, anyways. I just wish it would stay after we use it. You know, the rocks, you just have to rebuild it. This is completely safe. Do not try this at home, by the way. Okay. And of course, you have a lighter game edge. It's very important. You use a lighter. Zippo. Done. Toasty warm. Use fire. Put the container on there. Start the water. And by the way, I left my other container on uh, the other fire. My little, my little one, it's gone. My bad, but it is what it is. All right, we got that going. Uh, how are we doing on food? Just double check. I want to go to bed with a full stomach. You know, we can make a couple, uh, maybe the rice. Mm, looks tasty. Dude, it's water. Take it easy. Yeah, we'll make some little noodles. You can eat these raw if you want to. It's a noodle, but obviously uh, some water on it would be kind of nice. And uh, we have coffee too in the morning if you want to consume now the other thing i want to learn or make is a biden now that we really need to we can make a fire anytime we want to but i think to put out maybe the fire missing requirements spruce bark Ugh, drop that shit of course a horse is a horse of course of course uh I think there's one in here. Gonna need firewood anyways next to that fire, so. Damn it. Wow. Alright, so stone hatchet missing requirement. Oh my god, now I'm gonna be looking for rocks. Well, you know, I had to keep light and I kind of screwed that up, but that's fine. We'll make ourselves another one of those very shortly. I'll have to go back out and about to go and double check it. I'll make ourselves Biden and other things, but we'll leave the episode here. We did pretty good for today. Back in action for next episode. If you guys want to see more of this, please take time. Show some love by hitting the like button. If you're brand new, please go and subscribe. Thank you for being so amazing every single day. You guys are the best. This is Game Edge, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.